Hey guys, this is Kevin. Today we're going to talk about the absence error code 0335. This one is 033503. So let's check it out. Uh, we go to bchtechnologies.com and uh, 0335. I'll do a search. 0335. So it has something to do with a PIS sensor. <clears throat> Oh, by the way, this page has all the common uh, absent code. If you need this page on your cell phone, just uh, text the uh, word EPR, which is one word. EP means absent, absent error to this number, and that will text you back the page. There are like a bunch of errors, 501 to 507. For example, the one we have is 503. It could be a sensor, sensor error, which is contaminated sensor. So this sensor is right underneath the cartridge. So it could be there's a drop of ink drop on the sensor and it destroyed it. So that's what the contaminant sensor means. It can be a, uh, the damaged uh, FFC. FFC means the cable to the sensor. That's, that cable may be fried. Or the PIS board. PIS is photo sensor board. Uh, I'm going to show you PIS what a PI sensor is in a second. Okay. And uh, what I commonly see is that uh, this 503, 506, I usually see, which is a uh, light excessive error. That means this is an infrared sensor. So if, it, if it's too bright, uh, it's going to fail. Uh, how can it be too bright inside a printer? It's because you do not close the printer lid. And uh, there are some people just open the printer lid when they printing, and this will happen so that, that the light damage the sensor. And on the other side is insufficient light air. <laughs> That's just the opposite. How can it be insufficient when it's dark inside? It's because you got a detachment of sensor lag. Before we go forward, let's go get a replacement first. Okay, so we go to bchtechnologies.com. Uh, I'm going to put a link above too, so you can just click a link. And we go to ac uh, no accessories, printer parts, absent. And uh, on the left hand side, the different size sensor, we click a PI sensor. And uh, today we're going to replace this guy, uh, A1408859. This is a very commonly used uh, sensors for workforce and uh, expression XP and, uh, and a whole bunch of other models. Uh, it has the serial number, not serial number, it has a model number print on the back of the board. Just make sure uh, when you replace, make sure you have the same model number. Open up the printer and you're going to see the PS sensor right here. It's easier to move the print head all the way to the left when you do this. So. Uh, of course, shut down the power and uh, turn that wheel uh, counterclockwise three times. And uh, uh, then you can move the uh, printhead carriage all the way to the left. Uh, if you cannot figure out how to do this, you can power the printer on. When the printhead starts moving, just cut the power off. It's the same thing. This is how the cookies do stuff. Uh, there's one screw right there. Unscrew it, and the top metal place is going to lose. Uh, sorry about the lighting. Is the metal place is really flat, reflective. So I, I turn off the light to show you how to remove this. Uh, now there's a smaller screw uh, on the sensor. So just unscrew that one. The sensor will come off. The white cable is called FFC cable, and. Uh, the sensor, the black sensor, is on the piece of uh, circuit board, which is a uh, PS board. Remember, the blue part of the, uh, the FFC cable is towards the sky, so blue up. This is what it look like. Flip over, and uh, you can read uh, the model number on the top. Now we put our replacement in the blue side up and uh, there's double-sided glue underneath the FFC cable so you can just use, use your finger just uh, uh, even it it will glue to the, bo to, to the bottom 
I find it is easier to put the screws on the loop first, then put the whole thing in the printer, then then uh, screw it, then secure it. For the top plate, find that tab on uh, like a, a an inch from the sensor, and this plate should go underneath the other plate. Now we can put the other screw back. Let's see. Uh, right now it's too early to tell. And uh, notice that uh, ink icon on the top corner is grayed, and grayed out right now. So the printer hasn't finished checking the checking the PI sensor. Uh, right now it's checking. During this time, you can get a 03351 all the way to 033507. And uh, still checking. Now it's done. Uh, you can see the icon become uh, like a black. No more error codes and uh, the printer is ready to print. Okay, I hope you enjoyed this video. Visit us at www.bchtechnology.com or locally, Greensboro, North Carolina. And since you're interested in the PS sensor, I know you'll be interested in U12 uh, ice hockey. And that's my son Ethan, and he's playing defense this year for Carolina Stars. Oh, don't forget to get your COVID uh, booster shots. Cheers.